Okay, hello, welcome, Paula here. And holy crap, at last we are finally on the server. <laughs> that is a day. Now, I've been trying to find a, a decent server to record on. There's no point in me going on the nighttime server just yet until I've got a way to see in the dark. Now, I can throw flares, but it's not very enjoyable for you lot. Uh, I'm going to aim to try and get some sort of night vision goggles or a chem light as soon as possible. And then we're going to do some more nighttime stuff. But for now, it's really early morning. It is dark, but it's better than what it was. Uh, you can see the time down there. Now, that way is north. I checked. Yeah, look, north there. So the sun is rising in the east there and setting, and uh, the moon's going down. So, yeah, so basically, uh, it's going to get lighter and lighter. And I'm going to go ahead and use this as an opportunity to make my way north and I've got a few things to catch you all up on so bear with me as I do a bit of explaining now I don't know if I want to be here I ideally want to head I want to go north I reckon and we're just going to hit up whatever towns and whatnot we come across. Although there is something over this hill. Let me just get back up here. So, first things first. I'm not where I logged out at last episode. I haven't played since then. What happened was, the server messed up and I spawned on the coast just over there. This was early when I was trying to find the server and it's pitch black and so on. And I screwed up. Hey, what we got down there? A warehouse. So, before I go down, let me just explain what happened. Okay, I can't see anyone. So, I spawned on the coast and I looked around thinking, oh, it's too dark, I'll log. Then, all of a sudden, there's a player standing right next to me, like three meters away, five meters. He has a gun, he's looking my direction, I don't know if he's looking at me, and right then and now I had to make a split decision, take him out. So, I mean, now that I look back on it, I think, hmm, I might have been able to uh, sneak away. I might have been able to just disconnect because I wasn't planning on playing on that server anyway. But he then crouched down and he was still looking at me, so I thought, oh no, he's going to shoot me. So I pulled up my Winchester, aimed straight at his head, and shot. He went down. He didn't say it killed him until I took another shot at his body. Now, at this point, I can't see there's any zombies around or anything, so I was really nervous. He goes down, and as you can see in the debug monitor, I've got one murder and not that much humanity left. So, see, so yeah, if I kill one more player, I'm gonna be a bandit. I do not want that. So, there's no players. Okay. So yeah, that kind of happened, and I've, I did check out what the name was. Now I don't know what's worse that I don't remember their name, that I'm not too bothered anymore, or that the fact that I didn't record it. I really did wish I recorded it though. It's pretty nice shot, regardless of uh, me murdering someone. Now I'm taking my time because I've built up some nice gear. I'm just lacking a map really, then I will be well away. Bugger, that's the point. I haven't seen any zombies here. I don't actually know where I am. At least... Keep seeing things. Kind of out in the open here. I don't know what kind of server this is, and by that I mean there's uh, different ones such as uh, normal, veteran and hardcore normal you get everything, third person 
name tags on people which you can see at a distance and crosshair veteran you get the crosshair and third person no name tags and hard and uh, expert you get expert you get um, no crosshair and first person only and no name tags now I'm sort of worried I don't see any zombies here I'm doing this very very sloppily very sloppy what we got here oh crossbow now why I really would like the crossbow I believe it's one. It's that you can only carry like one bolt, or it's like one shot, and you can get that bolt back, and you can do silent takedowns on zombies. But I'd rather keep what I'm using now. Empty soda can. I don't actually have that much room. I'm going to leave that there. Oh no! Is that a chem light? Has someone been here? I don't know if that picked it up, but I just turned it off. If I'm playing a little bit weird today, it's because I've just got a new mouse. I'm not 100% comfortable with it yet. That's why I suddenly like jerk my view. So I see something over there, a house, or what, yeah. I have no idea what the road sign is. It's really hard to sort of scan the uh, tree lines in this uh, time of day, because it's very dark. If anyone's up on that hill, they're going to see me down here. There we go, just look like uh, time changed a little bit, it's got a bit lighter. Depending where I look. Okay, so I'm just going to sort of shadow the road there and see what's this way. Now, I kind of want to go north because. The more north you go, the further away you get from the uh, big cities and the coast, and that's where all the players are. And then you do get people dotted around the world, but there's a less of a chance, you see. Now, I didn't really want to head this way until I had a hunting knife, but I'm currently figuring that I can risk it and then. I'm seeing all sorts of people die in chat. Aha. So what we got? I don't think you can enter that house. I don't particularly want to go back down there. I got my got my bearing, it's north, so that's where I'm going to head. It's getting a lot lot more visible now. There's another building there. Whoa! Zombie, first zombie I've seen. He's kind of out here. I 
I don't want I don't want to be a player uh, I say player killer um, I don't want to be one of those guys that runs around and kills everyone that I come across I'm not like that and uh, I don't you know I don't find it fun perhaps if I do need gear but I mean it's not that hard at all to go and find a place to uh, you know scavenge from but if someone does you know aim at me and it seems like I'm gonna go down I'm gonna do what I can to survive so so yeah I have a feeling I'm gonna be a in the bandit skin before too long although that is going away soon there's some pretty cool uh, updates coming out they're not out just yet now I heard that I don't know if anyone saw that white dot in the corner there of the screen but apparently that's to do with it's to do with uh, creatures that are around that you can sort of hunt so I'm just sort of so I'm seeing things around me and I'm just realised I'm in the open here a bit and I kind of want to get into cover ASAP but I see a big tower over there so uh, quite a few of you have been asking to come play now, I'm going to have to work something out because it is incredibly difficult to try and find a server that has room for multiple people on and is not full. And preferably daytime because if it's not daytime it's going to be really hard to uh, find anyone to meet up. But I'm not going to let that stop me. So, the best advice I can give at the moment is if anyone wants to come play with me on uh, Daisy go to asheshq.com sign up and by the time this video is out I should have a post up on the news page on the very home on the very front page which will uh, tell you what to do Chances are it might just be idle in the chat room we got there until you know we're loading up a game. We'll just leave your details in uh, in the form thread. One or the other, I don't know yet. Saver means danger. There's a drop or mines. <laughs> oh wow! I think it's a drop. I shouldn't be too difficult to spot up here, but I just want to have a quick, quick nose. But no, let's get back. Oh wait, 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 wait. It did say I loaded up at the quarry when I uh, killed that guy, but I was a bit further along, so I'm guessing this is the quarry. I have no idea where the quarry is. There are places down there I could go check out, but it also seems to be a spawn. Um, to be honest, I just want to get into a position where I can get uh, get gear. I heard there's very good loot up north by the airfield, but that's like a hot spot. But if I can get gear, well, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I've seen a map of this area, of the entire continent, like once or twice, and I know how it's shaped, and two sides, the bottom and the right side, are coast. Or is it the left and... But, okay, if the bottom and the right side are coast, or south and east, then that would be... Well, yeah, that is east, so the east is there, that's coast. So, the airline uh, airfield is probably way that way and I'm basically traveling up the coast a little bit okay I kind of got my bearings I mean I've only seen I'm almost tempted to print off a map because 
I know I said I didn't want to, but to be honest, there's not much fun sort of roaming around and not knowing where to go. But we'll see. Right now I need to... I had a bit more inland though. At least get across that uh, road. And as I was saying earlier, I'm not going to take the lives of the survivor unless I unless it cannot be avoided. You know, they're looking threatening and you know. So if that happens, sorry, buddy. I can feel that's a, that there that there is a water pump, and you can fill up your. Uh, canteens there which is kind of handy but I'm full and I've actually got some spare okay I, there's too many zombies down there and it's very close to the coast now I've I mean I don't have that much in the way of arms on me yeah just this Winchester and actually I've got a pretty good uh, setup in terms of weapons but to gamble it all on this little area, which is so close to spawns and to a high concentration of zombies, seems a little bit silly. So I'm just going to move on here. Now I'm doing this in a very stupid manner. I'm just trying to go for it. I just want to get the hell out of here, to be honest. Oh. Zombies. <sighs> Making me nervous. Don't need to trigger finger now. Okay. That zombie's pretty far up. Whoa. What the hell is that? I don't know what that is, but we'll check it out here soon. Uh, it looks like some factory of some sort. We've got three big buildings we can check out. Now the only way I'm going to do anything, or get anything, is if I take risks. So I'm going to go ahead and have a look. I've got plenty of ammo. Let me just check my 1911's reloaded. Why do I only have one mag? I feel like I've balked up where I've put all my... I don't understand how I can switch stuff in between my bag and... I don't know. In fact, I don't even have too much room. Hmm. Alice pack 1 out of 20. Does that mean it's got one more space? Alright, well, let's put the water bottle in the Alice pack. Nope, that didn't do it. I don't need two water bottles on me. Okay, now my Alice pack is full. So I've got two two spots open. Okay, that makes sense. Oh man, I'm in a bad spot. That's a zombie. Bloody crawling zombies, I tell ya. Okay. I look like I'm in a fairly open area, but there's no immediate zombies. Alright, come on, let's do this. That's that crawl I'm gonna go in the side entrance. There's something in there. Whoa, what happened to my Right there we go. Leave my damn uh 